I picked up another bargain today in the wood collecting business. These two planks, hardwood, Aussie hardwood. That one's 2.3 meters long, and that one's 2.5 meters long. Uh, both 45 mil thick, and both are 240 mils across. And then I got some off cuts as well and junky bits there and some floorboards uh, yeah all those bits and pieces there guess how much I paid for all of that zero So I've cut off a couple of uh, metal protrusions there and vacuumed the floor. Now I'm going to use this El Chibo laser to see if uh, I can tell if the floor is level or not. Uh, yeah, the left corner of the room and maybe the right as well so the, there's a bit of a hump in the middle is what I'm trying to say. That's square. The uh, level is touching the concrete there, not touching it anywhere else, and it's against the outside of that stud. If that wall is my base, both those walls are skewed. It is what it is, but it's only 35mm over a 2 meter run. So I've got these two baseboards just laying there at the moment. Um, this one needs about 5mm shimming on that end and about 5mm shimming at the back. This one, don't know about levels yet, but it's too long. I need to cut it. I need to cut it about in line with that.
to back end to end. I've got 10 mil there, uh, 11 and a half there, 10 over there, 18 over there, and about eight in that corner there. I might stick the laser on it now and see. Little laser. Right at the top of the board. Pretty damn schmick. Squared in nice and solid. I'm going to cut the fronts off.
bound to happen. I've already done one side, just persevering with this. I cut it out, the bulk of it out with the uh, jigsaw and then flush it down close with the hand saw, the pole saw, and then get it perfect with the uh, sander. underneath for spacers to keep it off the floor uh, these are spacers to put them on uh, I've got a couple of screws in here I can take this out again now put some final screws in drawers are behind the kickboard. Two secret drawers. left access there for the plumber and the electrician for the dishwasher and the sink over here I'm leaving 
room for the electrician for the stove and cooktop connection uh, and the only reason I'm insulating this wall at all is because it gets direct sunshine from sun up which is directly out there to about 11 30 or 12 o'clock in the day so that wall would always get hot in the morning so that little bit of insulation might help won't do any harm anyway 